Well, today we're having our Coffee with a Cop event. Um, it's the first one for this year for the Northeast Precinct. And the purpose of the event is just to get the officers to come uh, at a neutral setting and interact with people in the community, answer questions, uh, shop talk. We had some guys over there talking about the Cowboys and football and, you know, barbershop talk. Uh, we've also had other citizens come in and ask some questions that they're, you know, they're having concerns with their neighborhood. So it provides us an opportunity um, just to interact and let people uh, see that we're human, if, if you will, you know, interact with the officers in non crisis situations. What do the officers think? I mean, you have quite a few officers out here today. Yeah. What do they think about this? I think they love this. This is an opportunity for them to get out and meet people in the communities that they serve uh, and also just interact with them again in a non crisis situation and talk to them about everyday issues outside of just uh, things that are happening in a criminal nature in the community. In a lot of cities across the country, mm -hmm. the police have not had necessarily having the greatest relationship with the community. Mm -hmm. Omaha doesn't seem to be having too much of that problem. Is it because of things like this? I think Omaha is a trendsetter when it comes to engaging the public uh, concerning police and community relations. Um, we've done things like the Police Athletic League. We've done things like um, the Shop with the Cop events and obviously now Coffee with the Cop. So I think we've been kind of on the forefront of understanding that in order for us to serve our communities effectively, we need to get out in the communities and become one with them and that the inner the inner uh, the exchange between police and community is vital to having a healthy uh, relationship